Lagos, Africa. I welcome you to your number one entertainment show on Rigos TV. And on today's show, we have a lot of interesting gist and news to engage you with. Please, you need to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you don't miss out. All right, my name is Fresh. Let's get started. On the show this week, we take a ride into Fox Pop, event reviews, and top gist on flames. Stay tuned. First, Inkechi Blessings' marriage reportedly crashes. The Nollywood actress and her husband, Okoyemi Faligan, have confirmed the crash of their marriage. And next, shortly after his wedding, popular rap icon M.I. revealed his next album might win a Grammy. And finally, on the Grammy Award this year, Anjali Kijo bags the winner of the Best Global Music Album category ahead of Whiskey. Interesting gist, I guess. <laughs> All right, only a relate the revolution event as the goal tells was to be shut down. Let's take a ride into how the event went down. Stay tuned. Here live at the co-hotels for the revelation are really so sit back and relax while we take a run of every moment of the show so don't touch it i'll be right back let's get started what do you feel about arole and his comedy and why are you here basically i'm here to enjoy the show arole is an amazing comedian and i love his comedy because most of us can relate to it and right now nigeria is hard enough we need something that will make us laugh so this is like one of the comedy relief we need right now. Ladies and gentlemen, this is my son. Greater and higher. I believe and I trust God for that because He's really He's an Ogo Himself, and the Ogo of God is unique. And then maybe that Ogo we kept on, we keep on shining and shining. For me, He does um, preferably skits actually because the way He dances and His garments and everything. I know, but also His stand-up comedy as well. Of course, He's very very creative in that as well. But I think I would prefer His skits, but maybe because I have been watching His skits. Well, of course, I will get to see that here and then judge. And how can you describe our list comedy? Our is a, is a, is real. It's natural. It doesn't force it. It comes naturally. You know, you know, a lot of people think once you are doing comedy, you need to be too serious. But if our is talking one on one, it's funny. So it doesn't force anything. It's just a real. It's a real comedy. In fact, it's not a comedian because a lot of people see his prayer as being like a comedy. All his prayers, it has, it have worked in my life, and it's still working in my life. So what are you talking about? Our is a real one. He's a prophet. Your girl in Kitchi Blessing Sunday. I keep watching Riddles TV. Riddles TV. Riddles TV. Riddles TV. Riddles TV. Keep it locked on Riddles right here. Is, is, is fresh, he's uh, passionate, and he's creative. And when you bring those three things together, you have an amazing uh, product, and, and that's who I'm, I relate is. And um, yeah, he's been doing this thing for a very long time, and I'm proud that he's, he's doing this. My brand is also uh, sponsors of this, which is Mini Me, 
And so, uh, yeah, so we're here to have fun. We want to see something fresh, something unique, something creative. And that's what I know that the brand that really stands for. That's what I'm expecting. For Arule, I would say it's more good at um, online skits. Yeah, than stand up comedy. Welcome back. Yes, how many square meals can you afford in a day based on the current food inflation in the country? Riddle's TV took to the street of Lagos to get some reactions. Check this out. Based on the current um, food inflation in the country, how have you been able to cope with your three square meals in a day? Um, although what I can say about this is, uh, as we all know that in Nigeria things have changed and things are very expensive, it's, it's, it has not been easy at all. Especially we that we are fast to none. So if you are earning 50,000 naira as a salary and year before, you will find it difficult to use it to buy your full, full stuff for now. So it has not been easy at all. The eating three times daily is actually been an hectic um, stuff for everybody because not everybody can afford a three square meal. Like me, I actually skip the breakfast then eat the lunch and the dinner because I think that should hold me for a day. So um, you feel the inflation doesn't affect you? Or? No, it does. It does. Actually, we can't always get what we get before because looking at tomato and pepper and all those things, rice and everything, it's up. You can buy 500 tomato, wouldn't reach you to eat very well and all. So you just have to manage yourself. Just continue to manage the money. Glory be to God. Actually, I'm not the kind of person that takes the risk I Per day, but so far I can take my two square meal, my uh, dinner, and my breakfast. Okay, so you skip lunch? I skip lunch. Uh, so it, are you saying the inflation doesn't affect you? Really, it do. But what will you do? Thank God I'm not lazy. Based on the current food inflation in the country, how have you been able to cope with your full three square meal? Okay, for me though, the kind of work I do actually basically doesn't actually counts because at times I may be in the office from morning till afternoon probably I'm attending to customers and probably I've never eaten but basically I know that once I'm in the office I get to eat in the office then once I get back home I get to eat that's just my that's the physical two things I know so basically I eat mostly two times in a day okay are you saying yes. the inflation doesn't affect you uh, I won't say the inflation doesn't affect you but at least I live above every other thing that happens in this country that's one thing I believe in so we got all things are possible Thank you for staying tuned and watching. Join us next time, same channel, Reduce TV. You can also follow us on Instagram and Facebook. Please go subscribe to our YouTube channel. Until next time, please stay safe and bye for now.